The quarterback slot machine keeps spinning in Philly and coming up straight lemons. Meanwhile, Terrell Pryor and the Raiders will try to take advantage of the Eagles' awful defense. This is your week nine clash between the Eagles and the Raiders in Oakland. Get pumped, football fans. With Vic still out with a hamstring injury, the Nick Foles era is back. Unfortunately, that means no Matt Barkley gifts this week. Barkley fumbled away any chance of starting at the Giants' two-yard line in Week 8. But then again, Foles looked awful against Dallas. Still, Foles had been solid before that, with 622 yards, six touchdowns, and no picks this season. And a fun fact, the Chip Kelly high-powered offense hasn't scored an offensive touchdown in two weeks. Now the hope is that Foles can help turn it around. The Eagles will have to get through Terrell Pryor's and the Raiders first, though. Pryor set the NFL record last week for longest touchdown run by a quarterback. Still, Pryor only had 88 yards passing and two picks in that game, and has thrown just five touchdowns all year. Deshaun Jackson was limited in practice this week, but is expected to start on Sunday. The wide receiver had gotten banged up over the last few years, but is on pace to set new career highs for touchdowns and receptions. Someone else who's always hurt? Darren McFadden. You were probably just happy to see him in your lineup, but he actually got into the end zone twice last week. He's healthy, and you can start him. And don't forget about LaShawn McCoy. Vegas is going with the Eagles here as they're favored by two and a half. Majority rules, four of our experts are picking the Raiders. How about me? Nick Foles, baby. I'm going with the Eagles. What about you guys? Let me know in the comment section or on Twitter and check out Bleeding Green Nation and Silver and Black Pride for all your news on these teams.